It's so good. Mm. another vloggy vloggy vlog <laughs> I know you people like it when I say that <laughs> hi my name is Judith Uro if you are just joining us on this channel don't forget to like share comment and most importantly subscribe so for today's vlog I decided to film a what I eat in a day because you all know I love food so so much so why not just film what I eat in a day I like to note something I don't eat the same things every day like I change according to my mood or what we have in the house or you know stuff like that so for starters I'm gonna be having this ginger shot if you want to know how I made this ginger shot I made it in one of my vlogs um, I'll be sure to put like the link in my description box and I also made an Instagram reels on it so follow me on Instagram if you want to see like a one minute video on how to make this ginger shot so in here i have ginger turmeric oranges um lemon black pepper and one last thing is honey the last one i made i didn't put honey but i had to like fine tune it because i really want to be taking this thing so first thing i do in the morning when i wake up is just take a shot That was good. Mm, way better than the last one I, I made without honey. I think I'll always put honey henceforth. So this is what I just take early in the morning, way before I eat. Like as soon as I wake up from sleep, I'm taking a shot. Okay. It just helps like detoxify my body, cleanse my body, you know, all that bloated um tummy from the night before. It also sort of like wakes me up in the morning, like that spice, that black pepper, that's kind of bittersweet taste yeah that's what this does to me it's also good for flat tummy and to lose weight if you have like ulcer um i don't advise that you take it because it will be way too hot for your tummy so please just do research on you know what to take anywho um it's time for breakfast now so let's make breakfast for breakfast we're gonna be having some tortilla wrap you all know i love a good tortilla wrap okay I'm gonna have that for breakfast. I'm making this for. Okay, I'm making this for two people. The rest of the people in the house, they don't like the tuna wrap. I mean, they don't eat it. It's just my husband and I because it's actually wheat. Okay, so this is the type of tuna wrap that I use. I know they have others, but this is like the most common of them all. Um. We do have some chicken soya. Uh, what else do we have? Oh yes. Oh, so nice. We have like some chicken soya in here. So this is what I'm going to be using for the fillings. Let's make breakfast. God, guys, I caught myself. What? Oh, this is so painful. It's so painful. Although it's not deep. But the thing about being a homemaker is that I still have to cook. So I'm just gonna wrap it up with um it's not deep at all so 
just going to wrap it up this also has to be like a good excuse for me to like <laughs> not cook the whole of the day you know so yeah So this is what it's looking like. This is definitely the first time I have made something like this. <laughs> like I don't know what it's supposed to be, but I was trying to like make tacos, but can you hear that? Yeah, that you know it has a bit of crunchiness. Yeah, I wanted that um, crispy kind of feel. So I'm just gonna fill it up on the inside. I know some people might like fish so you, yes you can do fish um you can do beef goat's meat whatever it's just you know proteins because um i'm trying to eat a whole lot of protein so i can build um muscles and lose fat item you so so much so I'm gonna go ahead with that I don't feel like taking anything um, you know hot so this is perfect So yeah, but then when it's cooked like this, like I said, I'm trying to incorporate more proteins in my diet and less carbs. So yeah, I'm going to try to finish off my meal, attend to some work, and I will see you guys for lunch. Oh, I missed this. So, you might be wondering, why does Judith always put her vitamin C in her wine glass? And the truth is just very simple. I love to beautify my life, even with the simplest, tiniest, Things like vitamin C. <laughs> I mean, I can also put this in a rubber cup. I don't even have a rubber cup in my house or an aluminium cup. I don't have that in my house. For example, let's say you go to a restaurant and you're selling vitamin C 
drink, for example, okay? And um, this is this is how it actually comes. Like, if you go to a restaurant, they'll never fill up your wine glass, except you like buy the bottle and fill everything up. But I don't know who really drinks a glass full of wine. Nobody. You just take it tete a tete, okay? But yeah, they give it this, and then they bill you for. 10,000 naira or maybe 15,000 naira depending on the restaurant that you go to so packaging is really everything and this way it just makes you want to drink vitamin C all the time it just feels like you're drinking wine if you get what I mean so yeah I just like to beautify everything in my life it's called the soft living <laughs> but yeah that's just me basically anywho we're gonna make you vitamin C for lunch we're going to have carrot stew with turkey and white basmati rice white carrot stew I know it seems weird right but your girl loves trying new things like I said I don't eat the same thing every day sometimes I just like to like think out of the box and just you know make something really nice and I saw this on TikTok one day carrot stew and I'm like this is a great way for me to like incorporate um, fruits in everybody's diet in this house because like I said I don't eat some of these foods alone okay like my family and i we eat it together and um they're not ones like eat fruits by themselves if i am not involved nobody would eat fruits how about that <laughs> so i just keep you know looking for ways to like involve fruits in everyday life so we're gonna make carrot stew so some days ago i got lots of carrots okay and i scraped them up um, put it in the bowl of water by the way this is how I store my carrots in case you were wondering I just remove the back and then I put it all in a bowl of water and keep it in the fridge if I'm not gonna use it like in three days or whatever you know I keep changing the water and everything so yeah guys let's get to carrots making so first of all we're going to have to steam this okay um I'm gonna get a pot
I like to boil my turkey to be so soft that even a baby can eat it. Like, I don't want to be having battle with my turkey. I don't want to be biting so hard or chewing so hard. Like, I just want to take a little bite and then my teeth dig in to the turkey. That's how much I love my turkey. <laughs> Look at this. What did I tell you? Like the juice of the carrots just sipped into the turkey. And what I like about this food is that it's extremely healthy being that it's carrots, carrots, fruits, vegetable, right? And that's just the stew. And I'm having like a little bit of rice and then a lot of protein. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna sit here, enjoy my meal. And um, when it digests, I'm gonna go to the gym because even if my rice is small, doing the whole portion control, I must still go to the gym, okay? the gym took a shower the girl feels good however when i was at the gym today geez i almost died like the workout was working out like the workout was intense today i changed my trainer because that guy is not taking me serious so i changed my tra actually not really changed my trainer per se but i think by next week i'll start working out alone so i'm just trying to like get my routines you know film me so that every time that i go there you know i'll just be training myself but yeah anyways it's time for dinner right now it's nine o'clock look at it it's nine o'clock and um i want to have dinner for dinner i'm going to have salad salad is like the best thing that you can have when you get back from the gym or when it's late at night and you want to eat salad i know that some people don't eat when it's past six o'clock seven o'clock eight o'clock nine o'clock i'm a mom i'm a family woman <laughs> like a family family of seven so i have to eat and i'm not saying that i have to eat because okay how do i how do i frame this now how do i put this i have to eat because i have to cook for the entire family and it's whenever the food gets ready that we eat okay so if i start cooking by say 3 p.m yeah because most of the times i make dinner by 3 p.m just imagine i start making dinner by 3 p.m so by five o'clock i'm done making dinner or six o'clock sometimes like did i made that burger so that's not good day that one took five hours i missed the gym <laughs> but yeah anywho that rice that we had was more than enough so everybody's had dinner i'm back from the gym i've burnt all the food that i ate and now i'm hungry sometimes when i get back from the gym i'm usually not hungry i just take like some shots or whatever like maybe smoothie drink but today i'm hungry okay your girl is hungry because my portion was smooth. so for dinner i ordered this um so fresh salad they sell it at my gym and i've had it before it's actually quite nice so that's what i'm gonna be having having salad at night makes you feel really light 
throughout the night and when you wake up in the morning it even makes you light like you didn't eat last night uh, some people might not like salad and that's because you don't make it sweet and by making it sweet I'm not saying you should go and add um, bama or anything like that I actually use this um, salad dresser wait let me show you guys okay um yeah this is the salad dressing that I use. It's called Brianna's Avocado Oil Herb Vinagrete. <laughs> you might should say. <laughs> yeah, so this is the one that I use. It's really nice. However, um, so far she gave me like some, what do you call it? Dressing? Dressing whatever? Yeah. Anyway, they gave me some. So, I don't know, it depends. Why I really, really love the salad is that it has like chicken, egg, avocado, you know, stuff like that that makes it sweet. Now I'm just going to go ahead with my favorite Brianna's avocado oil dresser. I really love this zobo. I don't know what made me buy it. I think it's the fact that it was looking bread and I've been loving watermelon juice ever since. Like this is so good. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my god, it's good. If I were to make this salad myself, I'll add some some actual chicken in it. <laughs> I wouldn't shred my chicken, honestly, because I want to have some chunks of chicken. If anybody had told me that I would like salad one day, I'll say it's a lie. <laughs> because when I was growing up, I hated salad. I mean, not hate hate, but. I, am not, I wasn't really a big fan of salad because to me it was not sweet but here's the thing maybe the stuff that I used to make salad was not sweet or they were not adding the things that would catch my fancy do you get what I mean like I think yeah I think it's salad cream the normal salad salad cream I think is hens or highness whatever it is h-e-i-n-z I think that's the spelling I think um I don't like the salad cream at all. I don't like it for anything. I prefer Bama, in my opinion, like then. I prefer Bama. But till now, I still like Bama. <laughs> but I found this one. And it was game over for me. Like, it just changed the whole thing. Then I found out that I can actually put um, chicken in my salad. I can put beef. I can put... I can put meat, I can put um, grilled potatoes, I like, I can put anything I want before it was just salad. So you see, this one doesn't even have sweet corn, but it's still nice. If I make salad, I'm gonna add sweet corn. I just try to find things that, you know, are really sweet to your liking, like they're good for you and also healthy. <laughs> but yeah, look at that. Once again, food, food, food is life. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. 10 out of 10. It's been a long time since I had the bowl. Let me just say I taste. Wow. Oh my god. It's good. This, like, tonight's dinner banks, okay? Tonight's dinner, it's, it's so good. It's so good. Mm. I just ate the egg. I just ate the egg. Guess what? My son now dances when he eats. <laughs> and I was like, who did he learn it from? Me. <laughs> I don't know why. But yeah, anyways, um, I'm gonna go enjoy my dinner, do some editing, rest. I'm really loving the fact that I haven't edited a video in like three days. I'm loving it. Like, yes, I'm vlogging, but I haven't edited. I'm still publishing on all those social, other social media platforms, but I'm not editing. Your girl is on leave. That's because I have backup content. But yeah, I think I'll start working tomorrow. Anywho, um, if you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section below. These type of videos are actually very stress-free. I enjoy it because it's food and you know your girl loves food a lot, okay? I love food too. The moon and back. Um, I'm gonna see you guys in another video on sunday 4 p.m another vibe another drill 
why am i so happy because the lad is so sweet <laughs> okay thank you for watching this uh, video let me know if you want um more videos like this i got more up my sleeve so ciao bella